All right. So Amanda, I'm going to let you go ahead and just give a quick introduction about you and then I will do myself after. Okay. Sounds good. So hi guys. Those of you guys who don't know me, my name's Amanda Busher. Um, I'm a presidential diamond with the company and I've been in it for almost five years. Like I just mentioned, um, this business, you guys, I have been in it when I have worked full time as a dental hygienist. This business has allowed me to be able to come home to my babies, be a, you know, a stay at home mom, but also, you know, an entrepreneur with this business. And so, um, you know, I get it. I get both sides. I get working full time and building a business. And I also get being a stay at home mom uh, building a business. Okay. Let's make sure everyone's muted. Um, I get sidetracked very easily. I'm like a squirrel. So you guys will see that too. Um, but this business, you guys, it has given us so much freedom and it's allowed us to, like I said, it's allowed me to retire my dental hygiene career after six months of being in this business. Um, I had a hundred thousand dollars in student loans. That I have now paid off about $80,000 of student loans of that, um, plus over $30,000 of credit card debt. Um, this business, you guys, has just been such an amazing blessing. And, um, you know, I always say, like, if you are new in this business, you guys give this business a shot. Like, don't just give it, you know, three weeks or a month or two months or three months or four months. Give this business an entire six months to a year, and I guarantee it will change your life completely. Um, you know, you be coachable and open to suggestions, be open to, okay, you know, Danielle is an amazing leader for, you know, her team and, you know, what she is doing, it, it works. It's gotten to where she, where she is at now. And so, you know, be open to, you know, suggestions. All of you guys who are on here right now, like, you know, give yourself, you know, a, you know, a pat on the back because you are, you know, taking time out of your night. You're taking time out from your family and you are pouring into yourself and your business. And I will say like you treating this business like a business, you're going to get paid like a, it's a business and you are taking that. And I think, you know, you're investing something into your business. So, um, I don't know. I just kind of just rambled, but I know a lot of you guys already know my story, but I think the biggest thing is that, you know, I just kind of follow those people who, we're doing this business and I follow those people who are rocking this business and really just being successful with this. I literally copied every move that they made and it got me to where I'm at. And so, um, and I just coach kind of what I have learned and it's gotten, you know, my team to where they're at. And so, um, I know it's, it's all about the duplication and keeping it simple. And so, um, so yeah, I'm excited to, to chat with you guys tonight. You are awesome. I love, <laughs> I love when you say you ramble because we get the best stuff when people ramble, when leaders ramble. everybody. So for you guys that don't know me, I'm Danielle Janiszewski and I'm from New York, lived in North Carolina for a while. And now I live in Arizona. Amanda and I actually met on the cruise and then we've done two one team, one missions together now. Um, so we have just learned so much from each other. So I love bringing our teams together. Um, and doing stuff like this. Um, guys, my story real quick is that I actually used to be a little bit of a hater just because I was so skeptical and I actually blocked people, um, on it works. So I need for you guys to know that if you guys have a, and I wasn't a vocal hater, I just was like, whatever, those raps probably don't work. And those people probably aren't making that much money. So, um, I ended up unblocking them and I joined and now I'm a triple diamond. So it's like, when you have somebody that you're like, did they block me? Did they, give it a chance. Okay. They have to come to terms with themselves and where they're at. But guess what? I was a teacher. I went to school for eight years and guess what? That means a lot of student debt. So when we got married, we didn't have a ton of money because I was a teacher. So, um, that would, that became my why I was like, well, I might as well just try to make a couple hundred dollars to pay for, you know, help pay for our wedding. And then it became more than that. And then I saw the vision and then I saw the big picture of really what this business could do for me. Then I got pregnant. Then I realized I had no family around me to watch my kids. So that became my new why. So if you don't have a why, you have to dig really deep and find your why. And if you don't think your why is big enough, you need to make your why bigger and you need to dig deeper and figure out what your real why is. And that right there, guys, I promise you is going to push you so far. So right now I'm a stay at home mom with both my kids. I retired as a teacher, special ed and math teacher. I had almost a hundred thousand dollars in debt when I joined and 
credit card. I was good with credit cards, but um, credit card debt along with a lot of student debt. So once I started to see the big picture, I just ran with it and I made that my goal. And then I want to be a stay at home mom. So now I get to work my business from my phone. No matter if my kids are sick or not, I get to work from my phone. So I'm really beyond thankful for this business and what it's done for me. And I'm just so thankful that I joined when I did because it's given me the opportunity, you know, that I have right now. So, so we are going to go over some really exciting things. Um, we both have a couple of things that we want to share, but we want you guys to really ask any question that you guys have. So if you are on this Zoom, you have a question, you have a topic, you have an area of concern that either you're struggling with or maybe your team is struggling with. So please, please, please put those in the chat um, so that we can touch on those. But we are going to touch on, you know, the promotion and how we're pushing it, what we're doing to be successful and share this with as many people as possible. Um, and how to utilize, you know, the connect app and you use that to our benefit because guys, that is such a great tool that the company has given us, um, that we want you guys to take the time to utilize it. And there's, you know, there's people that I've talked to that they're like, there's just so much information guys, we get it. And that's what we're hoping that this zoom is for is so that you guys can maybe feel a little bit more like, phew all right. I feel a little bit better. I feel like I know where I need to go and what I need to do now. So, um, so we're going to touch on the questions after we kind of give our, I, I want to say blurbs, but, um, Amanda, do you want to kind of touch on, you know, your stuff, like the promotion and how you're pushing it and how you're working it. And then I'll kind of share my stuff. Yeah, of course. Okay. Um, and I was going to say, cause I wanted to really go into like the connect app, but I don't know if you guys have noticed, but our, like it, the app is down right now. I was just going to say, I've been trying to get in and it is not letting me in. So yeah. I can, I've been using it so I can kind of say some things that I okay. remember, but I really wanted to show people, but, um, I'm totally fine with, you know, I can share the stuff that I know. Um, yeah. Okay. Sounds good. Um, so a few things, um, and I, have just been kind of, you know, teaching my, or not teaching, but like, cause we are all learning this right now. This is all new to us, this promotion. And the thing is you guys is uh, corporate is so stinking amazing. And they are, they have our backs like no other. And so this promotion that we have going on, it's kind of like a test right now. So if it goes really, really well, then I feel like they are going to like, this is going to be our new loyal customer program, but I want us to treat it like it's a promotion. Um, but that being said, kind of how I am doing it, kind of how I, you know, told a, a lot of my team is what I'm doing is I'm treating it like a promotion, but I'm kind of just doing the same as I typically would getting a loyal customer. So um, there's two things that I'm doing. And I'll, I'll put some of my verbiage down here in the chat. But if I'm talking to just a new potential customer, my verbiage is, is still the same. Like I'm still telling them like, you know, hey, this is what the cleanse does. And then when they ask what price it is, I still say, okay, this is how much it is. It's typically, you know, $65, but for this, it's going to be $36. You order this month, November, and then in December, sound good. So because I still want my customers to be on that three month commitment, even though they don't have to this month, I still want them to, because I want them to have the best results. I want them to, you know, have those, um, you know, I want them to get everything that they need to get out of these products. Now, the only time I'm kind of throwing in that they don't have to do the three months is if they're kind of hesitant. So if at any time they're like, oh, I don't know if I want to do, you know, the three months. And I say, you know what? No problem. Just try it for this month. And then we can kind of, you know, see where you're at, you know, after you do it. Um, and then I just sign them right up. So one of the things is that people are saying, okay, well, how do they, how do they turn off the auto shipment? So the thing is, you guys, is it's still the same checkout process as it normally would be. You still like sign them up as a customer, but they have the option to turn off the auto shipment if they want to. Okay. So that's the only difference, except we have awesome perks too. So I treat all of my new potential customers as if I already, if, as if they were already doing the three months. The only time I, you know, tell them about, oh, you can just order one month if you want, is if they give some kind of, you know, reservation about doing the three months. Um, now with my, with my current potentials, the ones who haven't signed up, so the ones who are like literally all on my list who have not signed up, 
this is the message I'm sending them. And you guys can copy and paste it. You guys can change it up to whatever you want. But I have been kind of tweaking things here and there. And this is the message I felt for me, it just has been working the best. Um, so this is what I send to them. These are for the people who have not signed up quite yet, but I've already talked to them about the products. Or these are for the people who were like, oh, I don't want to do the three months. Let me think about it kind of thing. Um, but you guys, here's my thing. When I have a new customer, a new potential customer coming in, um, the verbiages that we use, it works. So why break something or why change something if it's not broken is my kind of thing. If I have people who are totally for doing the three months, why change that and only be like, you know what, just do it for one month and then you can kind of see how you like it. No, I want them to, to order continually because we want to create that residual income for one. And for two, like I said, we want them to have the best results. And we all know that doing a product for one month, they're not going to have their ultimate transformation. You know what I mean? It's going to take, it didn't take them, you know, a month to put on their 30 pounds. It took them over time to put on that 30 pounds, right? So just like that, it's going to take them time to lose that 30 pounds. So we want them to you know, to, to continue ordering. So that's kind of what I'm doing. Um, and then the other thing is, and I, that's why I wanted Danielle to, to speak about the connect app is because we want, you know, we don't want to just, and I have been at fault with this. You guys, I will tell you, there are so many customers I signed up and left them in the dust because my follow-up system was just so poor. Um, but I will tell you that is no longer the case for a very long time now. So I treat my customers like my very best friends and I write them on my list. Um, and now that we have this connect app, it's going to make it so much easier to make sure that our customers do not fall through the cracks. So we want to make sure that our customers are really like loving the products. And so we follow up with them. And so you guys can do like what Kiami has been saying, like the two, two, to, or the, I don't know, maybe Danielle kind of knows the numbers, but I have been, what I typically do is I sign them up. I follow up with them in a week. Hey, I just want to make sure you got your products and going over any questions you may have. Um, and then after that, you know, I might follow up again at like at the end of the month, right after they use it, Danielle. Okay. So then I say, Hey, Sarah, I just want to make sure, you know, how did your cleanse go? You know, if they're like, Oh, it went awesome, but I still want to lose 10 pounds. Then I can say, okay, let's get you on these products for November. And so that's how I'm going to work with my customers. Hey, also just to let you know, you get, you order a product in November, you're going to get a $10 perk points, right? So every month that our customers are ordered, they're going to get some kind of perks. So we want to make sure that we are following up with them and that we're, you know, loving on them and making sure that they're loving our products. Because I will tell you, I have had customers that have been a customer with me ever since I've signed up. And it's because we have that constant communication. Um, that being said, I've also lost customers because we didn't have that constant communication. So we want our customers to be on, you know, the best products for them to reach their goals. And so I think it's really important since we do not have that three month commitment this month, you know, when we sign them up that we, we take our customers and we're really following up with them, making sure that they're loving these products, just making sure that they are, you know, having the best system that they can have to reach their goals. Cause we want them to be happy. Um, so that's kind of what I'm doing. And then I'm just like, I went live, like go live, take advantage of that. You guys. And I know it can be scary, but do you know how many people you can reach when you go live? Um, and it's okay. You guys Half the time I go live, my hair looks like this. Like I look like a wreck. Like my kids are running in the background. Like but that is life and that is what I do on a day-to-day -day basis. I work my business and it's a hot mess at my house, right? Like I'm a hot mess. So, but it's okay because I'm a human and that's just, people don't want to see perfect. They want to see results in what you're doing in real life. And so go live and talk about this new program that we have. Um, the other thing I have been doing is, I um, am starting and I'm calling it kind of like a subscription box. Okay. So like I did a post, I'm like, you know, who wants my subscription box? There's no, um, no fee, no startup fee, $49 free shipping, custom, you know, health and wellness products that are going to fit your needs. So 
you know, doing that kind of route, like everyone wants you guys. I just actually opened up a box of clothes because I have a monthly subscription to workout clothes. Okay. So people love those boxes. Like they love getting like mail in every day. So if we can kind of treat it like, Hey, you're going to have a subscription to some health and wellness products that you can customize and you can try different things here and there each, each month. You get free shipping, you get free products, you get free perks. Um, you know, people are loving that. And so, you know, make it fun. It doesn't have to be something serious or anything like that. Make it where people are intrigued and they're wanting this and it's an easy system. You know, it's an easy process for them to go and order. Um, so that's kind of how I've just been, I've just been kind of like taking it and just kind of doing, you know, different things to see what works. Um, and I think that the, the subscription has worked really well. I got two customers from it so far today. I just started it yesterday. So, um, but that's kind of what I have been doing for the program for the new program. Awesome. I love it. And, and I just want to add real quick that guys, this is why we follow top leaders because I saw somebody and I don't know who post about subscription boxes and I can't tell you how fast I copied and pasted what she had written because I love that idea. Like that's what so many people are doing right now is subscription boxes. So, um, yeah, absolutely. I love that too. And I, I threw that up and, and here's my thing is I'm, I'm kind of crazy with my Facebook posting. I don't like using like corporate pictures and whatever. I will take a picture. I drink the keto coffee every morning. So I take a picture every morning of my coffee, whether I use it that day or not, I don't really care. But I post a picture of me, my cup of coffee, maybe with my crazy kids in the background. And then I post, oh my God, the subscription boxes are amazing. I'm so excited. This new promotion. Okay. So people are seeing my personal picture with, you know, this verbiage that I basically just took from a top leader and reworded it and made it my own. And bam, I've already got three people that are commenting on it within half an hour. Okay. Mm -hmm. So definitely follow people guys definitely go live. <laughs> Can I just tell you, uh, first of all, my life is like in shambles right now. So, uh, if I, I could go live, but like, I'm, I'm a way more of a hot mess. You don't want to see me going live when I'm like this. So the other day <laughs> I try to go live as often as I possibly can. And guys, I was drinking out of a wine glass and I was drinking my collagen and people like, I'm the type of person when I go live, I'm like, what's up? Cheers. Like, I'm just like, I'd like to have fun. I'd like to bring out my sense of humor and I'd like to try to make people laugh. And I probably say things that people are going to be like, uh, she probably shouldn't go live. Like I like to make people laugh. So drinking out of a wine glass with collagen, I'm totally down with. So, um, I actually went live with my cousin. I was like, Hey, let's go live and we'll just talk about this and that and whatever. We talk about the promotion guys. We had so much fun. So I challenge everybody. If you are uncomfortable with going live, find a sideline, find an upline, find a downline, whatever, find somebody and just go live with them and talk. You don't have to be like, so it works came out with no, stop it. Like just be yourself and have fun and then like work it into the mix kind of thing. Um, yeah, I love that. And I think that that also takes like the, the heat off of you, you know, cause you have somebody else right there with you and it takes the pressure off for sure. Yeah, for sure. Definitely. Um, okay. So I'm going to first touch on the connect app. It is not working. So it kind of, kind of annoys me. I can't like walk you through it type of thing, but um, guys, I have to tell you that I was super intimidated by the connect app. Now, if, for people that don't know what it is, it's the office app, but it's the little messenger thing at the bottom. It intimidated me because there was just so much, but I said, um, I just need to take time and, and really like dive into this and, and learn about it because I'm a wicked green and it really excites me. And once you figure it out, it's going to be amazing. So I took some time, figured it out. And guys, in one day I sent out almost 200 text messages to people. Okay. That's a big deal. Um, so basically it imports all your customers and all your distributors. And I have in my phone, like potential customers or potential distributors. And how I put them in my phone is P L C P D T. That's how I put them in my phone. Um, I'm sorry. I totally got sidetracked. I watched a video from the guy in the backwards hat that just hopped on today. And that was an amazing video. So I just have to give you a shout out. <laughs> oh, that's Jane. <laughs> so He's great awesome. video today, by the way. Thank you for doing that. That was totally random. <laughs> and can you believe he just signed up? Stop. Yeah. No, no way. That's God. impressive. Oh, he, he gets it. He sees the big picture. 
Yeah. Um, okay, sorry, sidebar. So um, guys, they have verbiage in there that you can just literally copy and paste. You can, you can do like the at symbol and name and like, you have to play with it. I'm not, I can't sit here and tell you, try this, do this, do that. You have to take time and you have to play with the Connect app. So um, there's verbiage in there. You literally type something up. Now I'm kind of weird when it comes to stuff like this because I can take an idea of a verbiage and I have to make it sound like me. I'm like, I'm not gonna, like Amanda always says, hi babe, right? I don't say, hey babe. So anytime I take something from Amanda, I have to change it and say, hey girl. That's just what I do. That's how I talk. So change things around and make it sound like you guys. Um, so I change it around and then you can go through and you literally go click, 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 click. And you tap on every single person that you want to send the message to. Then you're, you're ready to send it and it gives you the option to send a text message or an email. Well, I feel like for me, text message is like way better because it goes instantly and I feel like people are going to respond immediately. So I do text message and then you basically, it's going to go to each person's name and it's going to come up and be like, Amanda, and you have to just press the send button. Or if Amanda, if I'm following her pretty closely and I'm like, oh my gosh, she just went, she just got back from Orlando. Guess what? I can go in and just type real quick hope your trip was amazing to Orlando. And then the whole thing goes send. So you can even customize each, each one as you're sending them out, or you can just sit there and press send, 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 send to all these text messages. Guys, I was having people respond to me before I was even done sending all of these messages out. That's amazing. It's an incredible tool. And right now for a follow-up, it's absolutely incredible. So um, for me, I am setting timers in my phone for when I need to follow up with these people. And all I have to do is go right into the Connect app. It takes two seconds and I go to this person, I have the verbiage already saved, click send and it's out. And I did my follow up. So once you get into a system, once you get into a routine, it is going to be a lot easier for you. But starting that off, it's like going to the gym. The first day at the gym really sucks, okay? You're sore, it sucks, it's like whatever. You just, you're out of your comfort zone. You see people you've never seen before. You don't even know how to use the machines. Like it's, it sucks, okay? But guess what, a month later, you are rocking that gym. You know exactly what machine to go to. You know exactly how to use it. Okay. It's the same kind of idea, but you've got to stick to it. You've got to stay consistent and you have to have a routine. Okay. So yeah. that's kind of my connect stuff. Do you have anything that you want to add with the connect app? Um, no, I think that that's perfect. Um, uh, Danielle sent me a video, which I was trying to see if I could put it on here. It's just a simple video. I think uh, on our, on my team, I think I sent it to a lot of people um, but I was going to try to put it on here, but I couldn't pull it up for some reason, but I wanted to do, I have it too. So let me, I'll try to pull it up. Okay. Um, I asked Danielle last week, I'm like, girlfriend, like, what is this connect app? Like I'm, I'm not a green, you guys. So like, to me, it's, this stuff is so foreign, but she was like, just take 15 minutes to kind of play around with it. And I did. And I'm like, this is so genius. Like this is going to save us a lot of time. Yeah. It might take a little bit of time to put things into place. But once it is, I think, like she said, 200 messages sent out like no other, you know? And so, um, unfortunately, it is down right now. But I know, like, Aspen, our field director, she sent a message saying that it was going to be, it should be up soon. So I know that the corporate's working on it. For some reason, it's down. But um, I just shared the links. Um, there's two trainings. So I say definitely watch the trainings before you really dive into it. Um, yeah. That would definitely help. But I think that, I think it's just an amazing tool that we have. And just to follow up, because I think that, you know, they always say fortune is in the follow up, you guys. And, you know, we plant seeds and a lot of times things get missed. And so we don't follow up or we get discouraged and we're like, oh my gosh, they said no. So I'm not going to follow up with them. And so this is going to be a tool to help us remember to follow up with people. Um, Cause fortune really is in the follow up. It takes about seven to 11 times before somebody says yes to you. Yeah. So you definitely want to use this and utilize this tool that, you know, corporate is made for us. Yeah, for sure. Absolutely. Okay. So I'm going to touch on the promotion and how I'm utilizing it and how I'm sharing it. And guys, I'm a green, I'm a little bit crazy when it comes to organizations. So bear with me. Okay. Um, now before I share all my things that I'm doing, I need for you to, to, to recognize one thing. The things that I'm doing do not 
need to be the things that you're doing. Okay. This is why you watch different zooms because you, if you're like, Oh man, I like that. Or I like that form. Guess what? Amanda has all these same things that I'm using, or if she doesn't, I'm going to send them to her. So, um, just take little bits and pieces of what I'm doing. And be, if you love one idea, latch onto it and run with it. Okay. Um, all right. So number one that I wanted to touch on was, was what Amanda said. Um, guys, I have customers that I have been talking to forever. I am not going to be like, yo, guess what? You get to sign up for one month right now. Let's get you started. No, I want to follow up with those people and still push the three month idea, the three month concept, because here's the thing. I want people to get the best results possible. Okay. So those people, I'm still kind of having those same kinds of conversations with them. Um, but new people or people that have been hesitant or people that are like, I don't have the money to do the three months or whatever it may be. Those are the people that I'm really reaching out to, um, about that, um, about this. And I can share the verbiage too, um, with you guys of the things that I'm saying, I'm actually even reaching out to distributors on my team that have totally fallen off. And I know they love the products. Hey, guess what? You can hop back in right now as a customer for one month. Do you know how many of those people are like, heck yes, let's go. Um, so here's what I'm doing to keep things organized. First and foremost, I have my hundreds list. Okay. It is, it's, it's A, B, C, D. Okay. Every letter of the alphabet and it's organized by their name. Okay. So say whatever D guys, I am going right down this list. I am sending everybody a message depending on the type of person. I'm literally going off my copied and pasted messages, my verbiages. And I'm like, Oh, she used to be a distributor. She used to do it. Whatever it is. I'm sending out messages like it is my job. Okay. I am posting on Facebook. I'm doing polls on Instagram, but guess what? I am not sitting back waiting for those people to come to me and be like, Hey, I saw your post on Facebook. No, I'm going to probably beat them to the punch and get a message out to them. So I am messaging like a mad woman. So hundreds list. This is really like my core right here. Okay. Now I also have, I'm not getting it. I also have my Facebook friend list printed out. So I'm going right through that as well. Okay. That's another thing. Um, can you share, um, just really quick. Yeah. Can you share just step by step how you print that out? I know it's, it's I, not that. Far. I can share a video. I'll share a video. Um, I, I'd have to search it and find it. Um, let me share a video with you. I have to search it in my team page and get it. If somebody on my team can go into diamond dynasty, search Facebook friend list, share, share the link. That would really be great. But um, I it, it, right now. watch the video. It's like two minutes. Um, and then it shows you exactly how to print out your Facebook friend list guys. I think I had like 150, 153 pages. Okay. I don't care. Print them out right now. Like this is gold and I have it grouped into three different groups and I am still working through it. Just be like, who is that person? I don't even know you like unfriend Bye. Like I want to, I want to clean it out. I'm not just like making it as a potential list too. As I'm going through it, I'm crossing people out. I'm like, nope, I'm going to go unfriend them. And, um, a lot of this, my system for this typically is if I'm watching a movie with my family or whatever, I've got this in front of me and I'm just, doo, 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 doo. it's brain, it's brainless. Katie Jarvis just shared it in the chat. So it's there. Oh, okay. Um, so I just go through this with a pen and paper while I'm just sitting watching a movie or whatever. And then when I'm like sitting down, like doing my power hour or whatever, then I go through it and I'm like, okay, delete them, follow up with them, add them to my hundreds list, whatever it may be. So that's kind of my system there. Um, all right. This is what I've been like pouring into the last couple of days because these are all my most recent ones. So I do a lot of host to post and the host to post that I do a lot of are number one cleanse because I have incredible results with the cleanse. So why would I not do the cleanse? Right. And then coffee, because not only do I have incredible results with the coffee, but I also um, can sell the crap out of coffee. <laughs> okay. So this is the chart that I use. It's a spreadsheet. Amanda has it. Um, and there's all my potential. So it basically says Denise and then who commented on Denise. Denise's post. So guess what I'm doing? I'm going to every single post that was ever put up. And honestly, I'm not using this to find them. I'm going into my phone and you know how they say it's it, where it saves all your host to post. Basically you can just go through each one and find each post. Cause they're back to back. 
Do you guys know what I'm talking about? Does that make sense? Okay. So I, I shared a picture last night. Um, guys, last night while I was nursing my kid, okay, I went through and I just shared a picture on every single post that I've ever done. It was a picture of the coffee and it said, 10 spots open, no subscription, no auto ship, blah, blah, blah. And I put my website on it. Okay. I've already gotten three people that have come to me. This isn't even me going to them yet. So I did that for every host to post. And then I'm going to make a new one tonight for cleanse. And I'm going to go through all my cleanse host to post and I'm going to do the same thing. Okay. Um, so this is how I organize my host to post. And that's how I'm following up with all of them for the promotion. Okay. I have two kids that are so beyond needy. I can't even tell you. So I work my business a lot on my phone. So when I have my power hour, when the kids are napping or when my nanny's here at nighttime, when I get to work my business from my computer, this is what I do. Okay. And I go through and I have a couple of different pages that I have to kind of like keep them organized. I go through my, um, messenger, Facebook messenger. And I'm like, Oh my God. Okay, I gotta write her name down. Oh yeah, she said she wanted to order. I'll put a star next to her name. So it's all about staying organized and it's just another way to really have these people on your hundreds list. But for me, I'm growing my network so much. I'm having you know conversations with people that I really haven't talked to like ever maybe. So I wanna make sure I'm keeping track of these people. So for me, I feel like what works for me is I lose track of people in messenger because I work from my phone so much. I don't write their names down. So that's something that I have to do and I have to write their name down under, you know, on a new spreadsheet basically. Um, so those people I'm following up with. So I don't know if you guys know, but on your phone in the messenger app, there's a search part. Okay. So if I type in the word now, something I've been saying to people is I've, when I try to send out messages for a promotion, I, I try to use a keyword so that I can follow it back or I can search that keyword to then find those people that I've had conversations with. So about this promotion that we have going on, which yes, treat it like a promotion. Do not act like this is completely changing forever. Stress urgency and treat it like a promotion. I'm calling it a secret promotion. Okay. Why? So that I can go back and search the keyword secret promotion and every single person that I talk to about it is going to be there. Okay. So I'm going to show you real quick how I do that. So if, even if I type up secret, okay. Do you see right here how it says search messages right there? That's what you're going to click on. Okay. Click on search messages and then all the people that you've said the word secret Okay, or secret promotion, whatever, um, are going to pop up. So it's going to bring up all of those names of people. So that's something that I'm doing. Obviously, I'm doing polls. I absolutely love polls on Instagram, and then they carry over to Facebook. Um, search keywords, guys. Green light messaging. Oh, like that's where it's at, and that's where it's at for me. Again, I work my business a lot on the fly. I work my business with my baby in my arms. So for me, it's like, oh, check out who's on online right now. And I never word vomit. I never like say this huge thing and just send it out. Heck no. I'm going to be like, oh, Amanda's online. Hey, Amanda, what's up? That's it. Why? Because I want her to get engaged. I want her to be like, oh, hey, how are you? Bam, I got her. Let's have a conversation now. Okay, so I'm going to send out, hey, girl, how are you? Hey, girl, how are you? Hey, girl, how are you? <laughs> to everybody. And then when people start responding back, I've got them hooked and now I'm going to have a conversation with them. Hey, did you hear about our secret promotion? That's, that's exciting for people. People are like, what are you talking about? I want to hear more about what you're talking about. So think about things that you can say to people to kind of grab their attention. Um, green light message is really where it's at for me. Um, I can get, when I get going on that, I can really get some people um, signed up and, and going. I'm going to share one more thing with you, but you got to take it with a grain of salt because I created this and then I believe I got pregnant and my life got crazy and then I never put it into play. Okay, but it's organized and it's amazing. So I'm gonna share it with you. So it's a loyal customer binder. I'm gonna just share real quick the, um, how it's set up. It's a great way for follow-up, okay? So this is basically it. Um, every single loyal customer that you have gets this, okay? So all it is is like their name, when they join, their phone number, email, um, if you place them where, and then their products that they used. So every single person has this same. As soon as you sign them up, you fill it out. Okay. 
Do you see that I have numbers? One, two, three, four, five K. It goes all the way to 24. So what I'm going to do is I signed a customer today. Okay. I'm going to fill it out. Her name's Shelly. I fill it out and then I'm going to follow up with her. Well, today's the 10th. So I want to follow up with her on the fifth next month on the fifth. I'm going to go to five, turn it, put her in there. So next month I'm going to turn the one and I'm going to follow up with all these people on the first of the month. On the second, I'm going to turn it. I'm going to follow up with all these people on the second of the month. Does that make sense? Okay. So it's a great follow-up tool when you use it and when you put it in play. So every person gets their own page basically with their information and then you're going to put it on a day. So if they're auto, say they're auto shipment, but they, they don't have auto shipment right now. So if their order potentially is supposed to go out on the 10th, then you just want to follow up maybe on the fifth or whatever it may be before that really goes out. So you can kind of touch base with them. Then use the connect app. Okay. So for me, I'm going to be setting alarms in my phone for those days that I need to follow up with these people. Okay. Questions on that questions on things. Um, do we want to go through questions right now? Do you have anything else that you want to add in Amanda? No, I think that's perfect. Um, okay. I'm just not agreeing you guys. So that's why I'm like, I want Danielle to talk about your guys's system because if you guys saw my system, I, it, my system works for me, but mm -hmm. you guys would be like, Oh my gosh. Okay. So I love that. And I love that little customer. I think that that's so awesome. I'm actually going to try to do that folder. <laughs> I love that idea. All right, so let's go through some of the questions. And I just wanna say, Amanda, some people are a lot like you, so your system is gonna work for people. Um, I'm just more of a, a green and like crazy organized OCD, so maybe my system might be a little overwhelming for some people, but um, take what you want kind of thing. What is the best way to approach new people and get them interested? Um, a lot of people ask me, how do you have a conversation with someone you've never talked to before? Guys, I friend a ton of people in mom groups. Um, my number one way to, I do not just randomly message people. I won't do that. It's not personal. Um, so I have people, I wait for them to see my story. I wait for them to like something. I go and engage on their page. And then that gives me a shoe in to really have that conversation with them. And honestly, all I do is say, Hey, thanks so much for viewing my story. Are you interested in, in doing what I do, working from your phone and making money and taking your kids to the park? And having that be your office too, something as simple as that. So that's kind of my thing, how I connect with um, people I've never talked to before. Awesome. Uh, the next question is, what is the best, or wait, sorry, that's the same one. Um, okay, what, wait, my question is on a post to post, do you just cold turkey ask everyone on your friends list? Um, I do. So the only thing is like when I add new people to my network, I don't message them right away about the business or anything like that. I do send them this message. Um, I just say, Hey, and I typically use their name. I don't say, Hey girl, or Hey, I just typically do yours, their name. Like, Hey Sherry, thanks so much for adding me as your friend. I look forward to connecting with you. Um, just something like that, just to kind of break the ice. Um, because then they're going to be like, oh, who's this Amanda girl? Um, and then they're going to go to my page and they're going to be like, oh, she works from home or, oh, I wanted to try that cleanse, you know? So it just kind of opens up and it instantly builds that relationship and instantly builds that, starts to build that trust. Um, but I do not message them about products or anything like that. Cause to me, it's just, you know, I don't want to ask somebody and then be, like hit them up on it with a product, you know, it's just not, that's not what kind of business we want to, you know, it just. People don't like that. So, um, but that being said, if they have been on my friend, you know, my friends list for a little bit and I've, you know, interacted with them, even if I haven't interacted with them, if they've been on my friends list, chances are I have interacted with them. Um, so I do send them a message. I go through my A through Z list every single day. So, and what I do is like at nighttime, like when I get off the Zoom, I'm going to start sending out my, I'm going to go, I'm on letter, I have to look what letter I am, but say I'm on letter E. I would go through all of my letter E's and just message them, sending that same post. Um, and my team, like you guys, we do, we do like a team like drawing every month. So I just message them that same message every single. And every we do too. Month. So we have the same thing, S similar idea. Yep. Yeah. So that's what I do. I message every single person. Um, I also, if I don't have like, 
say I'm talking to somebody about a, like a product and they can't afford it or they're like, I want to, but I can't do it now. I say, you know what? No problem. Do you want to get entered into the drawing that I have at the end of the month? They say yes. And then I have them yeah. post. I have yeah. also asked my current customers, like they just ordered and I say, Hey, I'm also doing a drawing at the end of the month. Do you want to get entered into it? I literally ask every single person because the more people you guys ask, the more people you're going to get. It's literally just a numbers game. Yeah. So I do ask everyone except new people that I added. Um, I'm going to skip the question. One question, since we're talking about host to post, somebody said, how, how do you get so many hosts to post out? For me, I'm going to green light message people, uh, the same message me like, do you want to enter my drawing this month for this cash prize or whatever product giveaway, whatever guys No, people are never going to say no. So for me, I green light message like crazy. Um, I'll also do polls. I'll also, you know, throw up a post or whatever. And if people, I take pictures, that's what this is for, by the way. Cause I'm kind of like, I try to pretend I'm a professional photographer some days. I'm not even close to it, but I'll set up like products and stuff right there. Take pictures of it. And then I'll be like, who wants to get, um, all of this for free because I'll do like $150 product giveaway. So once I have people, you know, I'll make it a poll or I'll make it a post. And once I have people that way, I, I can get host to post out that way as well on top of the green light messaging. Yeah. Um, I do the same. And like I said, at nighttime, I love sending out this message. I just posted down below. I love sending that message out before I go to bed because then I wake up with like tons of people saying like, yes, 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 yes. And so now I've already started my day off with like 10 people who want to do a host to post for me. So it starts my day off strong. Yeah. Um, okay. The two and then, question. Sorry, go ahead. Oh, I was going to say, just like what Danielle said, like, you know, getting posts out there, going live, being like, live, being like, Hey, I am doing a drawing for $250 visa gift card. Who wants to get to nerd in comment below. It could be a super fast two minute, one minute video. Um, Here's the thing, you guys, I have heard a lot and I've even gotten it a few times like, is this really you or is this spam? Especially new people just starting the business and now they're sending out this message. The best way is if they read it, if they have seen it, just send them another message and be like, hey, I just wanted to let you know this isn't spam. This is like a, for, like a real thing. I have a business that I'm doing and so we're doing a free giveaway. Do you want to get entered in? You know, let them know it's not spam because a lot of times when you, when people get a message that's like that, when they don't know you're in a business or they don't know that you're doing it, you know, that this is legit, they think it's just a spam. So they'll just ignore it. So just say, Hey, I saw that you viewed my message. I just want to let you know, like, this is not spam. This is really me. My, my business is doing a free, you know, giveaway. I just wanted to see if you want to get entered in, you know, yeah. something simple. Um, the next two people said they want to know about getting multiple distributors on board and then basically how to make sure that they don't quote unquote lose interest. So I'm going to let you speak to that and then I'm going to share one little thing about it. Sure. Yeah. So I work very close with like my new people. I have a system kind of set in place. So I just kind of say, okay, here's what we do first day one. This is what you're going to do day two. This is what you're going to do. And then like each month, so like this month I have my October rock stars. Okay. Last month I had my September rock stars, November. I'll have my November rock stars and we create a group, a system. And so it's really great because you know, you put together several different people who just signed up the same time or around the same time. And now we've already created, you know, a unit. Um, and so it's just great because we can ask questions in there you know, throw up posts in there. The biggest thing you guys is to create, um, I think a community with each other, you know, to let each other know that we're not in this alone, whether you've been in it like me for five years or you just signed up, like this is a business. We learn together, we grow together and we're in this together. And so that's what I try to do. And I think that, you know, it's really hard for us to motivate people motivate people. There's two types of like motivation. Somebody's going to have either you're self motivated or you need somebody to like, you know, send you a video to get motivated kind of thing. So why not, if we are leaders, why not just send them a video? Why not just send them a post? Why not send them something that can help them keep going? But I will tell you guys, ultimately it's going to come down to that person. It's going to come down to that person. If they want to take your advice, it's going to come down to that person. If they want to be coachable, it's going to be come down to that person in general. But we, you know, if we have a, a distributor that we just signed on, it's our responsibility to really guide them and lead them. And, you know, and, you know, 
show them the way of how it all works. So I love to group people up. Not only do I work side by side with them individually, but I also like to group people up um, in a group, you know, right away. Yeah, I love that. And we're so much alike. You can tell that we talk all the time. <laughs> um, so for me, I. of course, a lot of what she said, you know, I show them like, this is what we do day one, day two, you know, kind of like the training. Um, and then I kind of give them some ideas of what they can, you know, throw up or whatever. Um, but guys, for me, my biggest thing is I pour into my, my new people for 30 days, 110%. Like I give them my all. And if they ignore me, I still give them my all. I'm still blowing up their messenger. Like I kind of like don't care. <laughs> but if after that 30 days they haven't responded to me or they're like, you know, whatever with it, exactly what Amanda said is guys, you can't make people like want it. You can't make them work for it. They have to be really self-motivated. And that's why we're in this business is to really be our own boss. Guys, I was a teacher. Like I can't tell you how many principals I had that were like, I, I have two master's degrees and people, the principal was coming into my room, like observing me, trying to like catch me do things like wrong. And I'm like, what in the world? Like, this is so bizarre to me. And now I get to be my own boss. I get to do my own thing. I get to make my own schedule. I get to work from my phone. Like that's why we do this. So you have to have that self-motivation to, you know, want to better yourself and better your business to really better your lives. So, um, so yeah, I want to touch on that. Um, uh, when no one's wait. responding to host a post guys, you can bump them. You can go put a picture on it be like, Hey, these are my friends results with the coffee. Bump them up. If you really need to, you know, that that's things that I do at least. And you have to also kind of look at who is hosting a post for you. Like if it's somebody and they're sharing a bunch of stuff or they're posting every five minutes, chances are they're probably not going to have a lot of people comment on their posts on the post that they just made because their algorithm is completely messed up. Facebook is going to be like, uh, I'm not putting this out. You just posted 10 times in 10 minutes. So look at who is posting for you. And I always do that. Like I'm always like, okay, if I did not get, I just got 10 people to host a post for me. If I'm not getting interaction on that, I'm going to get another 10 people to host a post for me because you guys remember it's a numbers game. It's simple as that. It's just a numbers game. So if you take out all the emotions, all the people telling, you no, all the, you know, all that, just remember it's a numbers game. Um, Hey, quick question. Have you ever asked anybody that doesn't have interaction on their post? Have you ever said, um, Hey, will you tag some people that you think might be interested? Have you ever done that? I don't know why it just came to mind. I haven't, but that's a good idea. Cause I was like, as I was going through last night, putting that picture up, I'm like, son of a gun. Like a lot of these people like haven't even had a, a like or a comment. So I was like, it's kind of like asking them for a referral, but maybe say, Hey, feel free to tag five people in the comments of my post. I don't know. Just I like, love that idea actually. And you guys could even just do that off the bat and I I'll try it out to see it. You could even just say, Hey, you post this, make this and post tag tag five people. people in it and you'll get entered into my drawing. Ooh, yeah, I, like yes. I like it. I like it. I like that too. That's, that's just a genius. And the thing is, you guys, is when you get tagged in something, every time somebody comments or likes, like you get a notification. Yes. So. Yes. Um, Nola said, what's the best way to talk to people, new people? I kind of touched on that with what I do. I guys, if you're posting to your story, people see it all the time. People that you don't even like know that you're friends with see it all the time. So you easily have a shoe in to talk to those people. Yeah. Um, how do you get sales on keto coffee wraps in keto energy? I get a lot of keto coffee. Um, so I can do this one. So what I do you guys is I try to post at least once a day, either in my story or on Facebook about the keto coffee. Um, and I just say who wants samples. And a lot of times like people will be like me, me, me. So all I do is I just message them Hey girlfriend, I'm super excited to send you out some samples. They're five for $20. What's your address? And I can get you, I can send some out to you. Um, mm -hmm. I don't say, that's all I say. Um, sometimes like on one of my keto posts, you know, if they're interested in more information, I just say, Hey, are you interested in more, some more information about my weight loss coffee? Um, and they'll say, yes, I give them some information. I give them the price and they're like, yeah, I don't know. I want to try it first. I say, no problem. I can send you, you know, five samples for $20 if you want. So, and what I do is I just have them send me the money through Facebook. You guys, every, like, 
last month, I think I made like almost $500 just in keto cash. So, and, and I remember like, I was like, oh my gosh, like, but the thing is you guys, I, so I'll get keto coffee in my auto shipment every month. Always. <laughs> but do you guys remember when they did the, the fit coins? And like all the stuff that corporate like comes out, or if you guys just get your 150 shopping spree, you guys get some keto cash. Sell yes. that keto cash. That is instant cash in your pocket. Yeah. Then you take that keto cash that you just made, buy more keto coffee, sell them again. You guys see, you guys can make some instant money. You guys literally, if you guys buy this keto cash and or the keto coffee, you buy the the three or the four packs or whatever, buy three, get one free. You guys, that is huge amounts of money that you can make right there. That is your conference money right there. Yeah. So, but the key is, you guys, is again, it comes back to consistency. I don't just post that once every yeah. couple of weeks. I'm posting something about my keto coffee every single day. Maybe every other day if like things have been kind of like this promotion yeah. going on our trip was kind of crazy, but I try to at least go live or post about my keto coffee every single day. And you guys, that keto cash just comes flowing in. And I will tell you, it's just so awesome having that extra couple hundred dollars. Um, I couldn't agree more. I post about keto coffee every day. And can I just say one thing, guys, we built this business with wraps and greens and then hair, skin, nails came out and we were all like, oh my God, so cool. Guys, <laughs> just to be like totally frank right now. I'm like, when's the last time I sold a wrap? Like what, what keto coffee is where it's at. If you don't have keto coffee on your gosh dang auto shipment, go do it now. Like I'm not even playing keto coffee is like insane. So this is what I do. I have little sample packs and I take pictures and I share sample packs. And honestly, I don't put out $30 for sample packs. I want people to be, honestly, I kind of want people to think that it's for free because it's a sample pack. And then when they say they want more information, I'm going to tell them how much it is and share that, everything that's in it. So this is what I do. And of course I'm like green, I need things perfect. So I tape the back of these things all together so they don't move. <laughs> and then I got these little baggies on Amazon and then I put this on the back. Okay. So that's kind of what I do, but I really push, I can, I can sell keto coffee to anybody I feel. Do you send um, that packet just like that to them or do you put it like in an envelope? I put it in an envelope. Okay. I'll put it in one of these. Oh, cool. Okay. Um, okay. And how much do you sell that for? $30? 30. Yeah. I have, and I tell people like, if you really don't want the wrap, like I can throw in, I can customize this. I always tell people, and I'm telling you, most people say, heck that. yeah, throw, throw three more, um, keto coffees in there for me. So mm -hmm. most people say they want more of the keto coffee, which I'm always down for. I love that. You guys, this is like, this is money that could be for your conference ticket. You guys, you yeah. can, like see that like this, there's so many ways to make money in this business. And I love that because you guys, like if you need money right now, you guys, sell, get your, like, if you just started and you still have that product credit, get those five customers, get that 150 shopping screen, make up packages like that and sell that. That is instant money in your pocket. Um, so that is genius. I love that so much. Um, what do you do to, when you post and you don't get responses? Guess what? You post again and you keep posting. I don't care if I don't get a response. Guess what, guys? I've been in this business for five years. And I know that people are stalking me. I know that people are still seeing my stuff, whether they comment or not. Um, do you know how many people I have talked to that I don't even know? And they're like, oh my God, Parker is so cute. That video where he was, and I'm like, I'm, like, you don't know. You don't, people see your stuff, whether they comment or not, they see it. Um, yeah. Here's a little trick I do just to help with the algorithm, you guys. Um, I will make a post and if you guys see my post, you're like, why is Amanda comment on her own post? But I will make a post and immediately I like it and I put like a little emoji. Um, and sometimes you guys, if I am like, okay, this is a dang good post and nobody is like, nobody's commenting on it. I'll ask like my group chat. I'll be like, Hey guys, will you guys go give my post some love and I'll do your, I'll do that in return for you. Ask your team, like, in our October Rockstar group, you guys, or in our Diamond Rounds group, whatever, if you're not getting, not in our Diamond Rounds, because that's for different, but like in our team pages, you guys, like if you're not getting a response on your post, just be like, 
hey guys, will you guys go give my post some love um, and I'll do that in return for you. And that will just bump up the post for you guys. It just helps with the algorithm. Yeah. So do that. But Danielle's right. Like just because somebody's not liking or commenting on your post does not mean that they are not seeing it. Yeah. Okay? So many people be like, Amanda, I watch your lives all the time. Like, tell me about the business. I'm like, you watch my lives. I'm like, why don't you comment? Why don't you, like it? you know, exactly. you don't. And you're yeah. so just because they are not watch or liking or commenting does not mean that they are not seeing it. So keep going. The key again, you guys, and I'm going to say this probably a million times tonight. The key is consistency. Yeah. Hands yeah. down. Um, I'm going to share one little quick tip that I do sometimes because sometimes I'm like, gosh, dang it. That's a good post. Why are people not seeing this? Well, I'm like crazy. And I put 20 exclamation points at, at the end of things. So guys, I will go to edit and I will delete an exclamation point and then go to save. And guess what? I just edited my post and bumped it to the top of the news feed again. So that's something I do too. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. That's um, good. Yeah. Any ideas to get our DTs more excited and see end results? I think getting them on Zooms like this and sharing people's stories. Yeah, getting events, um, yeah. Zooms, like that kind of stuff. When, when we stay plugged in, when we go to things, you know, I know it's kind of corny what they say, like you show up, you go up, but it's so true. You get them to things, you show up and you go up. But the thing is, you guys, here's what I say. Like your team is going to go at your speed. Okay. Mm -hmm. If you're excited, if you're happy, if you're, you know, killing your business right now, guess what? Your team is going to be like, whoa, Danielle is rocking it. Like, what is she doing? Like, I want to get on her, you know, on her level. They are going to go at your speed. So if you don't come to team trainings, don't expect your team to. If you don't come to events, don't expect your team to. If you're not posting, don't expect your team to. Mm -hmm. So your team is going to go at your speed. Um, yeah. But then again, you're going to have people who aren't. So those people, you know, walk with your walkers, run with your runners, and, you know, and you just do your own thing. You stay in your own lane and do your own thing, and your team will follow. Um, next question is about how to get people to sip in samples. I love this question because I love sip in samples and I do them at my house. Okay. So I have my nanny come here, take care of my kids. I invite all of my team. Okay. So it's more like a team bonding as well. And then I invite my community. I invite people on Facebook. I create an event. And then this is something that I've just started doing and I absolutely love it. I use this handy dandy little thing over here to take pictures and I put up every product that I sample at my sip and samples, shake, greens, coffee, collagen. Okay. You get where I'm going with this. And then I post and I do polls and I say, who wants one of these samples for free or who wants to try one of these for free, whatever. Well, people are going to think that I'm going to send them a sample. I want, basically I'm pulling people out of the weeds. I want people to show they're interested. Then as soon as they show they're interested, I invite them to my sip and sample and say, you get to try every single product in that picture at my sip and sample. So not only am I having a sip and sample, but then I'm pulling it into Facebook and Instagram and I'm pulling people out of the weeds. And my, I have a huge network on the East Coast because I'm from New York and I lived in North Carolina for eight years. So guess what? If somebody over there is interested and they can't come to my sip and sample, they can get some of my samples and buy them from me. So it's just a way for me to really start those conversations. How do you organize your potential customers? I think we kind of talked about that. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, I have a system for, okay. Do you write down everyone's name? I do my best. <laughs> I, I very much so try to. Yes, I do. So what I do, you guys, and again, my system is not anything fancy at all, but I have this notebook. And so for instance, like January, I have January potential distributors, January potential loyal customers. I have my host to post in here. And then I have January loyal customers. Um, and then I know like in February or, I mean, my system's not the fanciest, but I know like, okay, in February, I go back to my January loyal customers and I just follow up with them. So that's kind of how I do it. But now I'm going to start to do like the app. But then, so like I go and I go to February. So now I have potential loyal customers, potential distributors, and then my loyal customers. And then, so I know you guys. So right now I'm literally going through, I can just go, okay, these are my January potential distributors. I'm going to go and I'm going to follow up with them. 
Yeah. So now I will say Amanda and I are very similar in the sense that they that we like to write things down. Okay. So I write my six list down every day. I actually have, um, again, this is all like consistency and, you know, um, being organized, but I have a six list that I basically print it out and I just cut it out every single day. I tape it to my computer and I go through, I'm a green personality. I like to check things off. So each one of them has a box next to it. This is the list that I do every single day. Uh, five to 10 host to post, follow up with other host to post, post on story, post on Instagram story, post on Facebook. That's like a given, but I don't know why, but I feel like I need to check that off. Post on Instagram. Guys, my team knows me very well and knows that I kind of suck at Instagram, but this last month I have been blowing it up and it is fun. Like, I'm like, oh my God, my poll is going to get fancy today. Like we're going to have fun with this. <laughs> so have fun with it. And guys, I've been in this business for five years and I feel like when you shake things up a little bit and like have fun with it, if you haven't gone live, you need to step out of your comfort zone and start going live. Like I go live without makeup on all the time. And I'm like, whatever, like who cares? Uh, I drink collagen, uh, letter of the day, um, follow up with current customers and then post in my team page. That's things I do every single day. No ifs, ands, or buts. Um, and then, so this is what I have. I have my potential distributors guys. I'm like, I have pen and paper. Like I just have to write stuff down. So I'm going to show you real quick what this is. I buy them in bulk off of, um, Vista print. I make them. Okay. Vista prints the bomb. Okay. All I did was take corporate pictures and I just made my own notebook. That's it. And then I buy 10 of them. Okay. I even do them for like team prizes and giveaways. It's just lined paper. It's nothing special. I but, love that. But yeah, so I just want to share that. Um, okay. Next question. How many friend requests do you send in a day? Ooh, ugh, uh, at least, at least 10, if not 20, like I'm constantly trying to <laughs> build my network. So here's my thing on that. Like if you're doing host to post, you're getting a lot of yes. new people. I don't even really send friend, friend requests yeah, anymore because right. I do so many host to post each day. So I'm getting, I'm getting so many friends, but if you are new and you are under that 2000 friend request and I say send out at least a hundred friend requests, add at least a hundred people, like send out at least a hundred friend requests. Cause you send out about a hundred, you're going to get about 20 people to add you as a friend. Um, so that's like your quickest way. And it doesn't take too long to add people to your network. So you can do that, you know, in 10 minutes. Um, someone said, do you use phone numbers instead of using Facebook? Uh, I, do they mean in the connect app? I'm not really sure. I, will, I have people saved in my phone um, under PLC for potential co loyal customer and then PDT. So guys, I just go to my phone and I type in PLC and then I can pull up all those people and I'll send messages out that way. What products did you try right away and what are your top sellers? Okay, if you're new, you have got to find one product and become obsessed with it. Find the one product that you're most excited about. Uh, for me, it was the greens at first, um, but guys, I can sell the crap out of the cleanse and I can sell the crap out of the coffee and I can sell the crap out of Fit30. Why? Because I've gotten incredible results with all three of those. What are your top? You're, you're a cleanse and coffee. I know that much. Um, yeah, I love the cleanse. I love the coffee, the greens. Um, hair skin nails. I think if you're new, the hair skin and nails. I think if you're new, like try a new product each month and just find what works for you, what you love. Um, I kind of promote like the same products because those are the products I just love. Those are the products that I use daily. Um, and those are the products that honestly, like all of my customers are on. So uh, I mean, I literally use probably every single product that I promote. I love the collagen now. Like, so just, it's going to be what works for you, your body, what your goals are, but try a new product every month and see what works. Um, one tip I have is like take two products and just promote those that entire week. Um, instead of promoting like the Confianza one day, the greens one day, the, you know, cleanse one day, like take two or three products and just promote that the entire week. And you'll see you're going to get customers who are on those three products. Like I will, and I've done this, like I drink the shake every single day. Um, but it's not one of my top sellers, um, because I promote all the other products so much more. I do the shake every day, but, 
Um, if I promote the shake for an entire week, guess what I'm, my customers are going to be on my new mm -hmm. customers, the shake. So, um, take a product, a couple of products, like two or three, and just promote those for one week. And then the next week, you know, you can change up if you want, or you can do the same ones, but instead of mixing it up, cause then it just kind of, you know, um, or if like somebody has like really good before and after pictures, you guys post those up, that's going to give them several different products to choose from or, you know, be, um, interested in. So that's what I do. Um, somebody said, how do you find your host to post? So I'm just going to show real quick and then I'm going to share something right here. You're on your main page. Go to those three dots over there, click on more and then click on review timeline. Okay. So if you're somebody that you don't have to review, you want people tagging you in this. So you want your settings to be that you have to review when somebody tags you. So I can just scroll right down. And now mind you, I'm changing my picture. So I just created that picture. And then uh, last month I had uh, this picture. Now I'm just gonna say real quick, guys, everyone thinks that's me and my son. It's not, I got it off Google, okay? So just like, don't, like for me, I will never post a picture that totally looks like, oh, I totally Googled it. Um, and now that I'm kind of like talking about my Facebook page, I just want to show you real quick. If anybody follows me, you know that I'm obsessed with succulents. I'm obsessed with cactuses. Um, I'm a, my son's obsessed with dinosaurs. I'm obsessed with Target. And my daughter is 11 months old and she said Target today. It was the best thing in the world. So brand yourself. Find something that you absolutely love and share that everybody on my Facebook friend list, they're tagging me in cactuses, they're tagging me in dinosaurs because I branded myself and people think of when they see dinosaurs, they think of Danielle and Parker basically. Um, I lost where we're at in the questions. I think that right. we I'm, can we get the layout of the paper? Um, if you need whatever paper you need, um, message Amanda or myself and just let us know which one and we'll get it to you. Can you explain how to up and how much volume from your, hmm. can you explain how to up and how much volume from your loyal customers need to have as well as once you get distributors? I don't know what that means. I, I'm going to skip that. Uh, Marielle, if you can kind of repeat that in a different, explain that a little bit. Um, I send PMs to get people to host posts and they ghost me. Do you keep asking them? Uh, yeah. Did they tell you to like, did they unfriend you? Um, guys, there's people that have signed up on my team and they've been like, oh my God, I ignored you for like the longest time. Guys, people are busy. People have lives. We are not that priorities and that is okay. We're not expected to be. What is green light messaging? Oh, holy Hannah. I answered that in the comments. Oh, you did. Already. Okay, good. I send motivation. Okay. How do you ship the coffee? Guys, I tape everything down. So it has to be super flat. The flatter, the better. So I, um. What size is the bags? I can send the link. I don't know. It's just, if you type in packaging, clear packaging bags, I'll, I'll find the link and get it to you guys. What did you put in the sample pack? Keto coffee, keto energy, greens on the go, collagen, and then a wrap. And then I made this on uh, Vistaprint. And then of course a wrap. I love that. Oh, okay. Did we get through everything? Oh my gosh, I think we did. Yay. Does anybody else have any questions you want to add or you guys can unmute your mic if you want. I know we kind of went over. We try to keep these in an hour, but I know <laughs> some questions. So Amanda or yeah. Danielle, yeah. Um, I'm not sure if my question was answered. I, um, I think it might've got missed. It was in regards to the loyal customers. If they um, are signing up under, not under the auto ship, how does that affect our bonuses? Like, you know how you have to have, yep. you want person. them to complete the three months. So your job as their enroller, as a distributor is to continue them to get their three months. Now they can, they can go over a course of four months and just have to have three orders within those four months. So say they signed up today, they have their first order next month. They ended up skipping next month because of whatever reason that's fine. Your job is to follow up with them and figure out what's going on, get them their second order and then their third order that next month. So in regards to bonuses, you've got to follow up with them and make sure that they get those, those three months. Okay. So does that mean, um, you won't get a bone, like say if you sign up five loyal customers and they all did not do the auto ship, 
option, right? They all just did. So then you wouldn't get your bonus that month because if they They're choose not to do the auto ship option, that is okay, but they have to place an order. They have to place three consecutive orders. They can skip one month. So it has to be three orders within four okay. months. So honestly, and when they sign, yep, go ahead. I was going to say, when they sign up, they're, it's the same sign up process as we would normally do. They're still automatically doing the auto shipment. It's just they can opt out of it the following months if they want. They can cancel the auto shipment if they oh, want. Oh, I see. Okay. It's still okay. the same exact way. Yeah. Okay. Um, I was going to say something else, but I don't remember. That's okay. Oh, I'm going to tell my new people, if you want your shopping spree, don't just push for five people. Go push for 10 people. Okay. 10 people for one order. And then your job is to get five of them to go for three months. So that's going to be my, my little go-to. All right. Any last questions? People can feel free to mute themselves and ask a question. I just have to say just really quick, I know that we're running way over, but like you guys host to post work. So whether you have been in this business for a little bit or you are brand new, like utilize the host to post because that works. Like I will literally get like no less than 70 customers every single month from my host to post. It's growing my network and it's giving me potentials. The thing is you guys is everything I do this month is going to carry on to the following months. So it just takes that consistency. So if you are new and you're just getting into host a post, or if you are, you know, you've been with us for a while and you're just getting to host a post, like give it time, give it consistency. And I guarantee everything you do this month, you may not see like massive results, but I guarantee you do it again next month. You're going to start to see more results. And then the next month, even more results. You guys, people on who are doing this like consistently, are getting 30, 40, 50, 60 and higher customers. And there's so much like, you know, there's so many things that, you know, come with that. There's so many bonuses that you can get with that. You know, the more customers you guys get, the more, the higher your paycheck's gonna be. It's just how it is. Volume equals like, more volume equals higher paycheck. So utilize these host to post. It's not just something that works for some people and not others. It works for everyone if you're doing it correctly and you're being consistent with it. Um, I mean, you know, getting five customers is pretty amazing each month, but just think if you got 10 or 15 or 20 or 30, do you know how fast like you would be promoting? Do you know how fast like you would, you know, and just think all those customers who are loving the products, they become distributors. They want to start making money too. So your team can grow very fast, but it's just being consistent and doing it correctly, um, you know, and just doing it daily and not getting discouraged. You know, like I said, it's a numbers game. If you're getting two hosts to post out versus 10 hosts to post out, guess who's going to have more results? The person getting 10 hosts to post out. Um, so if you're, if you're wanting more results, just you know, get more, get more messages out, get more host to post out that kind of thing. And I really want to say, Amanda, I know you and I really have the same verbiage and stuff like that. And we are so much alike. And I feel like you guys, if you're new and even if you aren't new, whatever, like host to post is probably easier than you just sending out random messages. And do you want to know why it's because we give you the verbiage. Like we literally have guys, I have it all in text replacement on my phone. I can have like 20 hosts to post going on at the same time. And I just type one word, send one word and a whole verbiage sends. So it, it might be a little overwhelming at first, but I promise you give it a week and really push hard. And I promise you that it will totally grow your business. And if you're like, I don't know where to find this information, go on your team page, type in the word host to post or H A P and all the information is going to come up um, right there for you. So um, be consistent with it, push it. And the thing that's so nice about host to post is that not only is it bringing in customers, it's bringing more potentials. It's growing your network, bringing you more friends. Like it's, it's really the end all be all with everything and it's duplicatable. So if you signed a new person tomorrow, you basically just give them the verbiage, tell them what to do. Hey, here, watch Danielle's video on how to do host to post and bam, it's duplicatable. So yeah. All right. So one thing I just want to share real quick, and then we are wrapping this up. I'm going to get the recording up. I'm going to send it to Amanda. I'm in Amanda's team page. She's in my team page. The number one thing that I love about doing these videos is hearing what you guys have to say about them. So I'm going to put up the link 
And then can you guys do me a favor and please just share at least one aha that you guys got from this? Because that's the stuff that I really like to hear because we've been in this business for five years. So a lot of the stuff that we say, we've said it before and it might be repetitive. So we want to keep doing these things for you guys and we want to see what's working and what's helpful and what you guys love about these. So once we get these up, can you guys please just take one second and just share just one aha that really hit home with you guys? We would really appreciate that. Sound good? Are you going to post it in my team page or are you just going to give me the link? It's whatever you want me to do. Okay. It doesn't matter. Okay. I'll send you the link and then you can do it and we can tag each other in the post so that we can see the ahas. Okay. Thanks okay. for sharing all your goods with us tonight. Absolutely. You too, friend. All right. Everybody have a good night. Thanks, Thanks so much for taking time to be with us, you guys. You guys are awesome. All right. Bye. <laughs>